Good evening, I'm making this video to teach you how to get rid of the Apple iPad, iPhone, and iPod Touch Air 4005. Um, I had trouble with it for about 8 hours. This fix is not going to work for everybody, but should work for a lot of you. Um, what I did was I plugged it into iTunes. I'm running Windows 7 64-bit. Um, I tried to do a restore um, even, uh, with a downloaded IPSW file or just a complete restore. And I would start getting these errors on iTunes saying this device and then error code 4005. Um, so this worked for me. Uh, I tried different iOS's. Um, I tried different computers, but I could never get around it. What did end up working for me was I did a re restart of the computer system I was on, Windows 7 64-bit. I kept the iPad, the iPod, or the iPhone plugged in. And then I just restarted iTunes, or just started up iTunes, and did the restore again, and it went through. So this worked on three different devices, and I confirmed it today with two different uh, devices doing it again. So the firmware that I did this on was iOS 7.0.4. I, I had to do this after I got the jailbreak, um, Evasion 7 jailbreak tool that just came out. Uh, this was not caused from the jailbreak. This was my own fault because I tried to re-jailbreak. Um, these devices and then I tried to put a clean jailbreak on all of them. So that is what caused the issue But um, I hope this works for you. Good luck, and we'll see you online